Hello guys and welcome back to the Media Nights. My name is Ari. And I'm Denise. And today we're going to be watching Braveheart. This is a film that a lot of you guys have told us about, you guys have requested. And ever since we saw, I think it was Hacksaw Ridge, mm -hmm. I've been very excited to watch Braveheart. I mean, this is starring Mel Gibson and also directed by Mel Gibson. And I'm very excited to see what he's going to do with this, uh, especially after watching Hacksaw Ridge. We loved his performances in Signs and Lethal Weapon. I feel like he has huge range uh, as an actor. And obviously he also knows his way behind the camera. Yeah. So. Plus you can combine the fact that it's an epic it's just gonna be awesome like i cannot wait to see this it's gonna be a great time have been hearing a lot about this film you just mentioned to me that this was also scored by james horner if you've been keeping track he's one of our favorite composers so i cannot wait to see and well to see i can't wait to hear what he's done with the score here you know when a lot of you guys uh, hit us up and you're like, yeah, this film is incredible. Please, you know, we know that you it didn't win the poll, but please do it. You know, yeah. we had so many people reach out when once uh, they realized that it was seven who won. They were like, oh, no, you you guys have to do Braveheart as well, please, at some point. So I'm, I'm excited to watch this, guys. Thank you so yeah. much for joining us. If you guys want to catch the full length reaction, that's going to be available on our Patreon. And if you want to catch these reactions early, you can hit the join button and become a YouTube member. And also a huge shout out to Mehmet John Parcha. And Jonathan E. Thank you guys so much for becoming producer nice. We truly appreciate you and you guys help us keep the lights on. So thank you for that. We hope that you enjoy and we'll catch you guys after the movie. History is written by those who have hanged heroes. Huh. The king of England, a cruel pagan known as Edward the Long Shanks, claimed the throne of Scotland for himself. Oh. Scotland's nobles fought him and fought each other over the crown. Everybody Wolf. was fighting over that crown, huh? Yeah. Where are we going? The Gandrews. He was supposed to visit when the gathering was over. Can I come? No. Oh. Go home, will you, Maria? Feel the back of my hand. Go <laughs> him, will you? Not the back of the hand. So William is the adventurous little boy. Yeah. Wow. My goodness, this looks amazing. <laughs> this looks stunning. Shooting on location, man. That's what it gets you. It makes a difference. It really does. My Gandrews! What the hell? Holy crap, it's all of them. Kids too. Oh, oh no, no, William. Of course he wouldn't listen. And this is no <sighs> sight for a kid. No. Oh, right. oh, yeah. ah! oh, yum. Ah! Oh, Easy lad. Oh my god. What a haunting image. It will absolutely haunt your nightmares. We fight them! We cannot beat an army! Oh, it's a 50 farmers we can raise! And we do not have to beat them! Just fight them. All right, all right. They're just farmers and they're gonna go out and fight? fight? Man, the bravery. I hope they got the skills. I At least the basics. So. Where do you think you're going? I'm going with you. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna help. <laughs> hey! Oh. I need you to stay here and look after the place for me while I'm away. I can fight. He's got the spirit. I know you can fight, but it's our wits that make us men. <laughs> what a line. See you tomorrow. <laughs> Hell yeah. I really hope he does see them tomorrow. I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't have a good feeling about this. No, me neither. I can't imagine that feeling, watching your father and brother right off like that. <laughs> Gotta work on that aim, you know? Ooh! Ow! Get him, William! Beat his ass! <laughs> They're so young and yeah. alone. Tomorrow has already come, hasn't it? Or past even. Da? Yeah. They're still not back. No. How the hell is this kid gonna survive on his own though? Oh, what's that? Well, it looks like some of them came back. Yeah. I guess he already knows. Yeah. 
what the outcome is. William, come here, lad. How do you even break the news to a boy? You see the fear in his eyes, man. I. Ah. Shit. De profundis clamavi ad te domine. Luce at eight in pace. You could just see him, him trying to stay strong as well. Yeah, he also looks like he's not able to quite process everything. I can imagine it must feel unreal. Like you just saw them. <laughs> that is so sweet. It's a little moment of kindness, right? Oh, that is uh, that is a beautiful score. score. Yeah. Wow. William, I'm your uncle, Argyle. Oh. So he won't be alone. At least. Thank God. Well, hopefully he's nice. I hope so. Maybe provide him with some comfort. <laughs> Did the priest give a poetic benediction? The Lord bless thee and keep thee. It was in Latin. You don't speak Latin? Well, that's something we shall have to remedy, isn't it? Mm. The Lord lift up his countenance upon thee and give thee peace. Yeah, a loss like that on the family. Your heart is free. Have the courage to follow it. That's a great shot. Such meaningful dreams, huh? Yeah. Looks like his father saying goodbye one last time. Yeah. What are they doing? Saying goodbye in their own way. Playing outlawed tunes on outlawed pipes. <laughs> <laughs> wow. wow. I gotta say, the atmosphere is absolutely immersive in this film so far. Yes. It's haunting almost, right? He understands his pain. <laughs> Sword is bigger than him. I know. <laughs> First, learn to use this. Hmm, just like his father. He seems like he's going to be a good uncle already. Yeah. He seemed a little intimidating when he showed up at first. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he looks badass with yeah, the eye with and the all. the scar but and everything. The actor's doing such a great job at showing that under the underneath layer of warmth. Yeah. Even though his wards are very straightforward with the whole yes. discipline thing. <laughs> very good job, acting-wise. Many years later... Ooh, London. ...king of England supervised the wedding of his eldest son would succeed him to the throne. Damn, Sophia Marceau is in this? Longshanks had chosen the daughter of his rival, the King of France. Ah. Oh. He doesn't seem too happy. Longshanks would have to do the honors himself. That may have been what he had in mind all along. Oh, oh. I see. It wasn't really for the sun. But how will they believe our strength when we cannot rule the whole of our own island? Yes. <laughs> I sent for him and he sends you. Interesting. Yikes. If he wants his queen to rule when I am gone, then by all means stay and learn how. Please. Oh yeah. All right. Cool. Sounds like a promotion. <laughs> well shit, I'll take it. <laughs> She's probably like, I'll be the queen. When any common girl inhabiting their lands is married, our nobles shall have sexual rights to her on the night of her wedding. Wow. What? That should fetch just the kind of lords we want to Scotland. <laughs> taxes or no taxes, eh? Whoa. That's a bit sinister. That is so deeply disturbing. Yeah. Robert, the 17th Earl of Bruce. Longshanks is granted prima nocta. Clearly meant to draw more of his supporters here. Yep. Yeah. Indeed. These affairs in France keep him long overdue. How are they gonna play this? Yeah, that's the question. Hmm. 
Because I don't think they have the numbers to fight them head on. I highly doubt it. We're gonna have to be tactical about this. It's like they mentioned in the beginning of the movie, right? It's about this before the right. sword. Exactly. History knows, man. <laughs> yeah. It's the wits. Hey. Hey. I'm there assuming he is. that's William. <laughs> Has to be, right? Same blue eyes. Yeah. Similar hairstyle. Yeah. Coming back home, huh? What a party. <laughs> looks like fun. That looks awesome. <laughs> Again, so far they're doing such an incredible job with the atmosphere. It makes you feel like you're there with them. Yeah. I always love when a film takes their time to show some of the customs or things that they do. Right, it helps you understand the world better. Hmm. Ooh, you think I wonder that's if the, the girl. girl with the flower? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that was my thought too. Hey, get that eye contact. Let's go! Oh! oh. <laughs> Is that Mad Eye Moody? You've dropped your rock. Test of manhood. <laughs> you win. <laughs> the English won't let us train with weapons, so we train with stones. Well, a test of a soldier is not in his arm. It's here. Mm. Uh -huh. Nice. Here. <laughs> Oh, Ooh. damn. Oh, come on. You can't sucker punch him. Mm -hmm. Is that his friend? Oh, my God. He's grown, man. Whoa. He's huge. <laughs> Holy shit. They're grown men. Of course. Whoa. I could crush you like a worm. Would <laughs> oh. you like to see him crush me like a worm? <laughs> I, I love it. Just dudes being dudes. <laughs> he did not oh, move. He didn't. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> He's just taunting him. I love it. Oh, Ooh. right in the face. Should have remembered the rocks. I should have. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> Knocked him Damn. down. Get up here, Mickey. Well, we already see him, right? <laughs> Using this instead yeah. of the actual weapon. should have moved. Damn, he messed them up. <laughs> Great banter. Yeah, I love their dynamic. Yeah. Oh, oh dear. No, that can't be good. Here they come. They always come right in time to ruin the party, man. I swear, it's like they do it on purpose. As lord of these lands, I will bless this marriage by taking the bride into my bed on the first night of Oh, he's in this too. Yeah. Oh. <sighs> And fuck your noble rights. He's Chips from Sons of Anarchy. I yeah. love that guy. Don't He's kill him. He's a great him. actor. Such a helpless situation. And he just has to see how they take her. Yeah. Wipe that smirk off his face, yeah. <laughs> I hope him specifically yes. <laughs> gets what he deserves. <laughs> Good evening, sir. Ah, young Wallace. Grand soft evening, huh? Ah, it's that. <laughs> what do you want to have a word with her about? Oh boy. Would you like to come and ride with me on this fine evening? Such a fine evening. <laughs> <laughs> Madam, the rain is falling straight down, oh, slightly to the side like. <laughs> we'll see you later. Oh, the weather's just fine. It's hardly raining. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> we? Oh. She's out and about. Yep. It's you she takes her. after. <laughs> <laughs> it's you she takes <laughs> after. Oh, parents do that. Uh. It's like, 
<laughs> but anytime they do something good, it's like, oh, it's yeah, just one. like me, man. Yeah. I was always so good at math. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. They're showing us all this beauty. I have a really bad feeling about all of this. That's, yeah. Well, if I can ever work up the courage to ask you again, I'll send you a written warning first. Oh, it wouldn't do you much good. I can't read. Can you not? Oh, well, that's something we shall have to remedy, isn't it? <laughs> Aww. Nice. And what language? <sighs> wow, she gets options? <laughs> Rest, yeah. I don't know. Why should I be? Ask you chaque jour. Je bon à toi. Oh, wow. Do that stand on your head and I'll be impressed. <laughs> oh, don't tempt him now. Oh! <laughs> you any manners on your travels? Well, the French and the Romans have far worse manners than I. You've been to Rome? My uncle took me on a pilgrimage. Oh, wow. wow. So he's been around. Rien qui approche ta beauté. Oh, if only you understood that. Yeah. But I'm long here. He's so got her. <laughs> I know. <laughs> she is so in love. Yeah, already. it totally worked. <laughs> Man, it's the exotic languages. Yes. <laughs> yes. Come in now. Ah. I knew it. Nope. Yeah, I'm assuming you don't want to smooch. You know, in front of the parents. <laughs> mm. Oh, what? wow. Damn, he kept it? Wow. I mean, wow. he's just good at it. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> he waited to the last moment, too. Yeah. Like, he didn't just start with that. It's romantic. Good job, man. He played that right. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> he's, he's got the riz. He he does indeed. <laughs> he's also extremely charismatic in this. Yes. I come to fetch you to a meeting. Oh. My father was a fighter and a patriot. I know who my father was. I came back home to raise crops, and God willing, if I can live in peace, I will. God. No, well, he does not want to fight. Mm. If you can prove it, you may court my daughter. Until you prove it, my answer is no. no. Oh. Didn't I just prove it? No! 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 So is that a no? <laughs> Gonna have to prove it. Get that yes. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> gotcha there. Just frolicking through the woods. I love it. Well, that will all change when my sons arrive. So you've got children? Well, not yet, but... I was hoping that you could help me with that. Hey, I'm dead. That's smooth. <laughs> well, it's a bit sudden, but all right. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. I want to marry you. Aww. Now that's a proposal. <laughs> Please do not break our hearts. I know. <laughs> They're totally going to break our hearts. <laughs> It's just so beautiful, man. The visuals combined with the score just yes. hits you right in the heart, man. Hey! <laughs> what a show off. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, he's like his daughter is slowly going nuts. <laughs> are they? Are oh. they doing it in secret? It looks like it, yeah. They're just gonna go ahead. I will love you my whole life. I know you. Aww, you can see how much he loves her. Yeah. <sighs> They're gonna kill her, aren't they? <laughs> I, damn, I hope not, man. Thing is, I also have that worry in the back of my mind, because you know that the Englishmen are around there Oh, somewhere. the Prima Nocte thing? Yeah. Yeah, I think, in a way, I think it's a good idea that they're doing it in secret. So, about <laughs> those children... <laughs> Shall we practice a few rounds? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure he, he would love that. <laughs> yeah, her, I'm sure her parents are going to be very happy about this situation. I don't think she would tell them. 
I mean, that will kind of defeat the whole purpose of it being yeah, in secret. Yeah, but there's no way they're not going to find out. My dude literally said, I do not need your permission. I'm going to marry her anyway. <laughs> yeah. Very forward thinking of him, you know? <laughs> he was a visionary. Yeah. Here they are again. Oh, man. It's like every time you see them, your heart sinks. Yes, it really does. Mm. She's caught their attention. Yeah. Oh, you remind me of my daughter back home. That's a rep. <laughs> what? Hello, Lassie. Yeah, I was feeling. I had a feeling something bad was gonna Good happen. Good for you. Good for you. Oh what a what pig. Dude. Yeah. Good for you, yeah. F him up. Oh. That guy. Yeah. Oh. Hell yeah. yeah. Right in time. People. Oh. Are you right? Are you right? Oh shit, we gotta shit. Get her out of there right now. Oh no, they're staring already. You bastard! Yeah. Oh, come on, girl, come on. Ooh. oh yes. <laughs> Give them what they deserve. Oh! Ha, 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 ha. That infiltration, I love it. Please, I really need him to make it in time. I don't think he knows no. she fell. No. What? What the hell for? Well, you leave me with little choice. Oh, that is so heartbreaking. She's just trying to find him. Man, these people, man, I can't. <gasps> oh my god. I need him to kill every single one of them. That is so unfair, man. She was an innocent. Yeah, she was just defending, defending herself. herself. Oh, he's gonna lose his mind when he sees what they've no, done. It's gonna. I don't want it to break him, man. Oh. <laughs> he looks so imposing on that horse. He does. Yeah. Give them what, what they all deserve, man. I mean, surely he knows something went wrong already. Yeah. She was not there. She, yeah, from the fact that she never showed. Oh! Oh! oh yes! Get him, man. That's what I'm talking about! <gasps> you prick! Oh! oh. Damn! Yeah. <gasps> <laughs> Threw the Damn. entire sword at him. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, guys. Of course. Fight back. Oh. Jeez. Oh. That's a really bad oh, way to this go. Prick. Yeah, him especially. Oh my god. <laughs> He's a big guy. You know that swing hurt. Yes. Some archers on the top. Now. Whoa. Nice. That's so smart. Yeah, using that as shields. Oh no. Wow. Oof. He is strong. Wow. He's still going. Oh. Ho -ho -ho -ho. Good job! Dad's got a mean throw. These people have the spirit, man. 
No, 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 no. Oh, thank God. Nice. <sighs> yes. Good job. Hell yeah. Oh, I was hoping they would have yeah, gotten impaled. <laughs> I saw those things and I'm like, someone is definitely getting impaled by those. Yeah. yeah. Oh. The yeah. same death? You get to have the same fate. Oh. Yeah. Oh, man. And was it a goddamn day? Damn, that just hurts, man. You, you, we, we got to yeah. see how much love he had for her. And like they had just captured just a little bit of their happiness, like the life they would have had. Yeah, and he told us what he wanted, just a life of yeah. peace and to grow his own family. <laughs> this poor man, man. He's lost so much already. Yeah. It's so heartbreaking because this is not what he wanted, you know? Because I'm assuming all of this is going to have consequences. <sighs> Does he blame him? When you're facing that kind of grief, I feel like you won't probably want to blame everybody. Yeah, just burn everything. Yeah. What you waiting for, boy? Here, you can do it. I'll hold him down. Ah. Oh, it's gonna. Yeah. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Just Someone's hold him down. <laughs> you indulge me. <laughs> ah. Hold him. Hold him. Cauterize that wound. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> That's funny. Gotta wake you up in the morning, boy. <laughs> I'm your son! Somebody's coming. We heard about what was happening, and we don't want you Amadans thinking you can have your fun without us. That's right. <laughs> but you can help yourselves. Go home. We'll have no homes left when English garrison from the castle comes through and burns us out. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Everybody is in it. I'm loving this so far. The uh, amount of time uh, they took to establish the characters. Wow. Yeah. They also took time to build his relationship with her so we could understand how shocking that grief would be, right? An entire hour to develop his character. That's amazing. Yeah. Well done. That's how you do it, man. So I want news. Oh, Ooh. nice. <laughs> Infiltration. That's smart. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'll keep that, thank you. It'll serve me well. Yes. I have dispatched a hundred soldiers to Lanark. They will be returning now. What are they dressed like this? Actually, it was more like 50. Oh my god! Oh. That is badass. <laughs> That's so satisfying. Line delivery on point. Yeah, you little prick. I'm here to claim the right of a husband! Good for you. Yes. Yes! Oh, ho, ho, ho. Satisfying that karma. Is, that's justice. <laughs> Tell him Scotland is free! Burn it. Whoa. He's such a badass. And he still spared them so that they could yeah. give them the message. I don't think many people would have done that. He's fair, at least. Yeah. You know? The person that had to pay the price paid it already. Scottish rebels have routed one of my garrisons and taken control of the town. Stand up. Yep. So that is not gonna work. One day you will be a king. At least try to act like one. Yeah, dad is not happy, is he? J'espère que votre mari ira en Écosse. Votre relâche. Yeah. Damn. Imagine the situation that they're in. They 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 wish that upon someone. Must be terrible. I mean, to her, it could mean her freedom if he dies, right? I hope so. I hope that they would let yeah. her go. She would have to make a run for it. Essentially, she's still right royalty in a right. way. Oh, yeah. oof, 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 oof. oh my god! Yeah. 
on horseback, there's no way they're gonna outrun them. No point resisting. You're outnumbered and trapped. Now where are the rest of you? Are they? Oh. 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 Think again. <laughs> <laughs> Look at his grin. <laughs> they are wow. smart. He really is taking those words about, you know, yeah, using this. The wit. Yeah. I will gain English favor by condemning it and ordering it oppose to my lands in the south. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Sit down. Stay a while. So publicly condemning it and then supporting it in the background. And none of us and nothing of Scotland will remain unless we are ruthless. Give it right. to our noble. Yeah, you gotta be ruthless. Their minds is the key to the throne. So he's playing the politics game yeah. all the way. Yeah, get that good food in, Hell boys. Yeah. You need it. You need to build up your strength. So what we do? It's run, hide, the Highland way. There has to be a way, right? Take him down. Oh, he's gonna come up with something. Look at him. Hmm. Some men are longer than others. Your mother didn't tell you stories about me again. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> that is hilarious. I love it. I love the humor in this too. <laughs> yeah. It just lands. If I risk my neck for you, will I get a chance to kill Englishmen? Is your father a ghost? <laughs> Don't change the subject, just answer the fucking question. Mind your tongue. <laughs> Seen Irish. Oh. Hey, quick draw. Old man. That's my friend, Irishman. You fight for me, you get to kill the English. Excellent! <laughs> oh, That's he's all I nuts. wanted to hear. <laughs> Oh no. What? What what the hell is going on? <gasps> Wait, what the What is going on? Oh Holy shit! Sure didn't the Almighty send me to watch your back? I didn't like him anyway. <laughs> wow. He wasn't right in the head. That was such an interesting moment because I did not know who to trust there oh, right i, I suspected of him actually <laughs> wow turns out the madman is the loyal one yeah that was very well cut that was really yeah, well I done was like who are we protecting him from <laughs> who are we rooting for there I know. <laughs> great man that was a close call we are ready for a war <laughs> they're gonna get what they wanted wow the fight of their lives sterling funny because you can already see that it's growing beyond so much more than just them and their little town yeah right like wildfire oh my god jeez look at the just the framing of that yeah. all you see is men lined up that's so impressive though how many extras is that the coordination that's a lot of extras Jesus, man, that's so many. They're so badass, dude. Look at this. Yeah, stand your ground. Oh, your mullet. Got be no tall enough. <laughs> <laughs> wow, the word has spread. He's a celebrity. Wow. Yeah, news of him traveled far and wide, man. And if he were here, he'd consume the English with fireballs from his eyes and bolts of lightning from his heart. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that sounds about right. All of that is just legend. <laughs> that they may take our lives, but they'll never take our freedom! Wow, what a speech. That's the way to do it, man. <laughs> Fight. Yeah, you already know there's like at least five or six of them that are like, yeah, that's all cool, but I'm Yeah, I'm a I'm, I'm gonna just, just scooch past you back real quick. exit. Yeah. They seem quite optimistic to me. <laughs> Let me do the talking. Read. Read. Let's see how this negotiation yeah. goes. Yeah, it should be interesting. Where are you going? I'm going to pick a fight. <laughs> 
<laughs> I love the crazed look in his eye. Yeah. That's perfect. He's hungry for that fight. You got him, man. It didn't get dressed up for nothing. Yeah, come on. You're already ready to party. I said I have an offer for you. You disrespect a banner of truce from his gang. Absolutely. Whoa. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah. March straight back to England, stopping at every home you pass by. Do that, and your men shall live. Yeah. Do it not. And every one of you will die today. The balls on this guy. I mean, come on. You have to respect it. Yeah. Man, I love seeing how coordinated all of these people are. Yes. Like, people don't realize how difficult it is to film this. Like, a battle right. of, this, of this scale. <laughs> Look at those spirits. There you go. Whoa. All right, boys, what's the what's the move now? Okay, good. Oh, shit, dude. It's pretty small. Uh. Yeah, I was gonna say. Uh. Ooh. The Lord tells me he can get me out of this mess, but he's pretty sure you're fucked. <laughs> okay. Man. Glorious. They're like, what the hell is going on? <sighs> Jeez. Oh, oh, not in the ass. Oh. So it looks like the plan is working so far. They've been deceived. Yes, so far, everything is going according to plan. I wonder if they did this because they don't have ranged weapons, so they needed them to get closer in I order would, to go hand in hand, you know, hand to hand combat. That would make sense, though, because that way there's people in the field, so the, the archers right. can't really, if they shoot, it's also against their own people. Exactly. Oh, oh. oh that's genius. That is Ooh. smart. Oh, man. Took care of those horses. Yeah, please. Ooh. Oh. Wow, how quickly they turned the tide there. That's. They're much smarter than you thought they were. Yeah. And they're beating you at your own game, my dude. <laughs> it's not a good look. I don't think the king is going to be particularly happy about this. Mm, no, I don't think so. I don't think he will. Charging right ahead. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I love seeing that. The clash. Oh, no. Uh, oh, my God. That's the worst way to go. Stab right in the gonads. Hey, right in the jewels. <laughs> yep. Oh, right. <laughs> they, they're coming right back. <laughs> Reinforcements. Yeah. He played them so well. He did. Wow. Retreat! <laughs> Retreat, huh? All they needed was for all of them to be united with the common yeah. goal. Well, <laughs> took his head well, off. You boys did it. They massacred them, man. That was amazing. He's a great tactician, though. Yeah. Like we said in the beginning of this. Before yeah. this, yeah. <laughs> Tactics, man. My God. What a battle. <sighs> so well done. You guys deserve that victory. They really you do. You really were outnumbered and outmatched there. What? Are they knighting him? Sir William Wallace. They're knighting. Whoa. In the name of God, we declare and appoint thee guardian and high protector of Scotland, and thy captains as aide de camp. Stand and be recognized. Wow. Sir William Wallace. Wow. 
I love seeing how much love his own people have for him. Yes. Hey! Sir William! Where are you going? We have beaten the English, but they'll come back. Right. Right. Because you won't stand together. Well, what will you do? I will invade England and defeat the English on their own ground. Excuse me? There's a difference between us. You think the people of this country exist to provide you with position. I think your position exists to provide those people with freedom. Wow. And I go to make sure that they have it. Right. Hell yeah, man. Wow. He's got a way with words, too. He really does. He's reminding them, right? What this is all for. It's right. not just titles and yeah. luxury, you know? There, there's a purpose to those titles. Exactly. Your titles are not going to stop an actual army invading. But men don't follow titles. They follow courage. Now, our people know you, noble and common. They respect you. And if you would just lead them to freedom, they'd follow you. Yeah, do the right thing. Yeah, so would be I. better. Be more. He said it too, and so would I. Well, he wants yeah. to fight, right? We know that. Yeah. He's playing his father's game, but that's not what he wants. He feels it in his art, too, that it's yeah. the right thing. It's to stand your ground, defend your lands and your people. It's wonderful to see that he ignited that want in the people, right? To want more, to ask for more. Yeah. Double the wall, guys. Seal the gate. No! <laughs> it's great to see them shake in fear at the thought that they're coming. When they yeah. were once dominating so much and <laughs> shamelessly. I love it though. It's so satisfying. <laughs> yeah, he's being very smart. He's oh. attacking strong and quickly while they're still trying to gather their bearings. Yeah. Come on. Ooh. Ooh. Nice job, lads. Oh my god. Oh, oh no! Oh, it's hot oil! Boiling hot, yeah. Oh no. Shit. Well, I mean, what do you do now? You can't get in. Ah, oh, shit. Let's go, let's go, let's go, come on! They're still gonna use it. Yeah. Wow. Until they can't anymore. Whoa! Nice! Hell yes. Make ready for the king! Oh, he is in so much trouble. <laughs> not only has he not fixed the issue, it's gotten worse. Yeah. Oh dear. Stand up to him. I will stand up to him and more. Yeah, it sure looks that way. <laughs> I don't know, man. You gotta look a little bit more confident if you wanna, you know. Right. Gotta bring some bravado to your attitude. Yeah. Hey, Dad. What news of the North? <laughs> Excellent news. Oh, I heard the word in <laughs> France where I was fighting to expand your future kingdom. The word of my son is that our entire Northern army is annihilated. Damn. He heard all the way in France? Excuse me, sire, but there's a very urgent message from York. From York. Uh-huh. Wallace has sacked York. Huh? Wallace has sacked York. There you go. He did it. Yeah. Is that a head in there? Has to be. Little message. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. If he can sack York. He can invade your England. We would stop him. Who is this person who speaks to me as though I needed his advice? <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> is it, who is this guy? I have declared Philip my high counselor. Is uh -huh. he qualified? I am skilled in the arts of war. What advice would you offer on the uh, present uh, situation? I knew oh. it! <laughs> Dude, that's insane. I saw the open window. Oh, he was done with him. I shall offer a truce and buy him off. <laughs> yeah, think again. Who the hell did the king send, I wonder? I'm so curious. Uh... Oh... Yeah. That... Yeah, that tracks. I am yes. the Princess of Wales. I come as the king's servant and with his authority. To do what? To discuss the king's proposals. Will you speak with a woman? 
Yeah. <laughs> He's like, is this, a, is this a trap? What the hell? The executioner of the king's nephew, my husband's own cousin. York was mm -hmm. a staging point for every invasion of my country. And that royal cousin hanged innocent Scots, even women and children from the city walls. Yeah. Right. Exactly. Well, Longshanks did far worse the last time he took a Scottish city. Sanguinarius homo indomitus est. Et semper dicens mentatio. Econuncum pronunciare mentatio. All right, he oh! knows. Hamilton. Leave us. My lady? Leave us. No. Yeah, without him in the way, maybe they can will Have they be proper... able to plot something here. Ooh, I wonder. He proposes that you withdraw your attack. In return, he grants you title. Yeah, he's trying to bribe him. The last time Longshank spoke of peace, I was a boy. And many Scottish nobles who would not be slaves were lured by him under a flag of truce to a barn where he had them hanged. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he knows what his truce means. She was my wife. Married in secret because I would not share her with an English lord. They killed her to get to me. Yeah. They've done some atrocious stuff. Yes. But William Wallace will not be ruled, and nor will any Scot while I live. Aww. What a great just range in his performance. Yes, and I one thing I love about his character is that he is just as competent physically as he is mentally, mentally. right? You can tell he's intelligent, he's well traveled. But he also learned from the places that he went. Yeah, he absorbed that culture as exactly. well. Exactly. So he accepted our bribe? No, he did not. <laughs> <laughs> My scouts tell me that he has not advanced. He says he will attack no more towns or cities if you are man enough to come and face him. Ooh! Are, are you man enough? The main force of our armies from France will land here to the north. Of Edinburgh. Even if you dispatch them today, they take weeks to assemble. I dispatched them before I sent your wife. Mm. There you go, that's your proof. So our little <laughs> ruse succeeded. Thank you. And while this upstart awaits my arrival, they were in always York, gonna be doomed. Yeah. Now you know what kind of person he is. What kind of man is he? A mindless barbarian. Not a king like you, my lord. Yeah, of course not. Mm. No. Personal escort of the princess. Aye. Must have made an impression. I didn't think <laughs> you were in the tent that long. A message to my maîtresse. That's a little vibe, hey, okay? All right. Get it. Get her number, man. I know. <laughs> Get her digits. <laughs> How would they go about communicating? Slide into her DMs, you know? <laughs> this time, our only option is to negotiate. Now I just want to see people race to the ground. <laughs> Love that entrance. It's time to discuss other options. Other options? You still don't get it. If you'll not yeah. stand up with us now, then I say you're a coward. Damn. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Saying it how yeah. it is. When yeah, are you going to stand up and fight? When it's, it's true, won? though. If we join, we can win. If we win, well, then we'll have what none of us have ever had before. A country of our own. You're the rightful leader, and there is strength in you, I see it. You can see the spark in his eyes. Yeah. He wants this more than anything. Unite us. Unite the clans. Yeah, man, be, be the... Yes! There you go. Okay. Yeah, be the leader you were meant to be. I cannot be king. You and you alone can rule Scotland. What I tell you, you must do. Not for me, not for yourself, for your country. And we're not going to be privy to that conversation? Come on. I'm going to go ahead and assume not. Jeez, I... man. Because like, it's like you said, right? They're just prolonging the inevitable. Right. At this point, it's too far gone. Yeah. Obviously, the king has already made his own moves to right. hit them as hard as he can. Yeah. Use up the Irish. The dead cost nothing. And send in the infantry and cavalry. Jesus, man. Just using people like ammunition. Yeah. I gotta say, man, the, the battle sequences, they know how to rise up the tension with the score and yeah, it's, how they're editing it. It's funny because usually in movies, they kind of skip over the whole we're running towards each other to meet each other part. Yeah. Just cut straight to the clash. This, this has so, built tension. So much more effective, isn't it? Yeah. See, like, they take their time. Wait, what? What the hell? Ah, what? <laughs> what? Glad to have you with us. What's this? No way. 
But they're gonna join in. Hell yeah. Yo! I, my mind is blown right now. <laughs> he is so good. <gasps> That's yeah. so good. Are you shitting your pants right about now? I feel like you should be. <laughs> so it was his island. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. It really was. <laughs> God damn. Guys, come the f on, please. No, they're leaving. What? People. Shame on you. I gave Mornay double his lands in Scotland with matching estates in England. Lachlan turned uh, for much less. Wow. He bribed them. Pardon, sire. Won't we hit our own troops? Yes, but we'll hit theirs as well. We have reserves. <gasps> Reserves. They're human beings, bro. He does not care. As long as he gets the win. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Ah! Even the other guy, right? Yeah. He had more of a heart. He's like, won't we hit them? He's not yeah. even gonna stay to, fin to finish what he started. No, he's just leaving for his afternoon tea. What? Oh man, that's pretty close to the heart, actually. Ah, you can barely see it. Yeah. Well, he knows he's getting away. He's gonna go straight at him. So if I had this little time left, I would do the same thing. The will. Just by yeah. himself. Just by himself. Gonna, going to attempt this. Protect the king. Oh shit. Oh shit. Uh, He's got way more range. How the hell is yeah, he gonna do I know. this? It's a bad fall, man. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, get him. Oh, wow. That is just even worse. You fought against your own. Your own people, man. Somehow the look in his eyes just hurts way more yeah. than anything he could have said. Go! Now you feel like doing man. the right thing? Yeah. What the hell, man? You had it's your chance. Late. Way too late. Just hits you, man. I'm so upset, man. All these people, like, the plan would have worked. It was working, you know? That's what pisses me off. Now you look horrified because you have to wade through the carnage. I mean, what did he expect? I don't know. Like, what What was the other outcome? Did you think <laughs> they were going to win without your help? <laughs> Whatever he must be feeling right now has to be probably one of the worst feelings ever. Feeling regret after doing something yeah. like this? Good. All that guilt? I mean, he definitely deserves it, but yeah, it's just... Yeah, it must be crushing. I'm the one who's rotting, but I think your face looks graver than mine. <laughs> that's, that's funny. <laughs> Son, we must have alliance with England to prevail here. Shut up, man. You're just backtracking, man. They fought for William Wallace and he fights for something that I've never had. And I took it from him. 
when I betrayed him and I saw it in his face on the battlefield. The look in the eyes, the look that he gave him. I want to believe as he does. That's I his true character. The wrong side again. Great <sighs> performance. Wow. wow. I'll never be on the wrong side again. again. That was his true character. That's yeah. what I've been sensing the entire yeah, movie. That's why this whole decision came so out of left field. May someone cut your throat in your sleep, man. He's coming for your ass. <laughs> man. Oh. oh. Well. <laughs> Wait, what? Your Is worst nightmares. Real? Yep. Oh. Yeah. Damn, just killing him in his own home, I assume? Damn, he recovered rather quickly. He's gonna go for it. Oh, no way. Oh. oh, God. Damn, that's Did a... you just sacrifice your horse like that, bro? Damn, poor horses left and right, man. Jeez, man. Wallace rode into his bedchamber and killed him. More of a liability now than ever he was. And there's no telling who'll be next. Maybe you. Maybe me. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I'm serious, Robert. Yeah, he's yeah. full of rage as well. Again, must be such a horrible feeling knowing that you were part of that. What the hell? What? Lachlan. Oh. Damn, yo. Just left him a message Did there. Did he just stash his body and it just dropped whenever? Oh my god. It's William Wallace sure. And he's given up his sword. I like this trio. Yeah. Yeah, oh. get him. Yeah. Gonna barricade the whole thing. Oh, they're gonna they're set gonna it on fire. Burn them. Y'all want to play dirty? Oh, that's oh, the worst man. way to go. Damn, he's moving fast. He's getting shit done. He really is. Because he's uncompromising in his morals, his beliefs. Well, that's what makes him so inspiring, right? Yeah. That he's relentless in his pursuit of freedom. Wait, is he inside already? Oh, shit. That was great. He snuck in. He blended in so perfectly. That was awesome. I received your message. <gasps> this is the second time you have warned me of danger. Why do you help me? You know why. I mean, and she knows why. And we know why. Because of the way you are looking at me now. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah, that was some pretty uh, useful information there. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm sure that the whole shipment thing is going to come in handy as well. Yes, yes, food and weapons. <laughs> Amongst other things, yeah. <laughs> yes. And he's a prisoner of his own decisions. And so is he. Yeah, everybody. <laughs> She's over the moon. Sir William, we come to seek a meeting. I bet you have. You do know it's a trap. Tell him. I think if the Bruce wanted to kill you, he'd have done it already at Falkirk. Aye. I, I know. I saw. Right, leave yeah. him aside. That is also can, true. You can't trust them after what they did. I don't want to be a martyr. No, all right. I want to live. I want a home and children and peace. Dude. Yeah. Aww. That's all he wanted, man. It's all for nothing if you don't have freedom. That's just a dream, William. A dream? Just a Oh, and that, what have yeah. we been doing all this time? Right. What have we been fighting for if it's just a dream? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Let him talk. He knows how to talk to them. Converses with the Almighty himself. Yes. I'll see you after. 
right there. I love his character. <laughs> I love him. He's great. <laughs> it's so complicated, right? Because we do see this guy's inner monologue. Like, we know that he wanted to do the right thing. Yes. But he chose not to because of his father. So he's still guilty and he's still responsible. Yeah. But at the same time, you know, you can put yourself in, in his shoes. Yeah. All you can do is make it right now, man. Right. That's... It's also like, you know, the idea of what loyalty is supposed to be. Like, I feel like he couldn't shake that because his father kept telling him the same things. What if you feel like something's wrong? Something's wrong. What's happening? Careful. No! What's happening? No! Oh. No! Of course it was this trap. Oh, you assholes. Yeah. Father! Long shanks required Wallace. Oh, man. I don't want anything from you. Yeah. You're not a man! No, you're really not. You know what it means to hate. Oh, thank you so much for that life lesson. <laughs> what a despicable <laughs> character, man. <laughs> My hate will die with you. That's a great line. Don't give him anything. Yeah, don't give him any more control over you. Never in my whole life did I swear allegiance to him. He looks extremely good after being beat up, I yes. do have to say. He does. <laughs> Confess and you may receive a quick death. Then on the morrow you shall receive your purification. Is that a death sentence, or yeah. they're just gonna torture um, the shit out of him until he confesses? The king will be dead in a month and his son is a weakling. Who do you think will rule this kingdom? Now open this door. She's like, oh shit, well, I she guess she, a uh, point. she has full control now. Perhaps even live in the tower. In time, who knows what can happen if you cannot believe. Yeah, she wants to keep him alive at any cost, but... I will die, it will be awful. Every man dies, not every man really. That's true. Wow. I can't bear the thought of your torture. Take it. Just take it to ease her mind. Yeah. I mean... I guess? Better keep the, all that hush-hush, you know? I have come to beg for the life of William Wallace. You're quite taken with him, aren't you? I respect him. More than you guys. Right. Yeah. More than you pieces of shit. You are incapable of mercy. <sighs> Lived a horrible life, being a horrible person, and will die a horrible person. You see? Death comes to us all. <laughs> huh. Eventually. Your blood dies with you. A child who is not of your line grows. In my oh, hey. <laughs> damn, that is karma and he cannot speak. Yeah, I love that though, because even if it's not the truth, I mean, yeah, true. That's enough to just we don't even know if it's the truth, but I mean, could be. Oh, wow. Man, they're just gonna wheel him in like that? Yep. They're putting on a spectacle. Making it- making an example out of him. <laughs> wow. Jesus, man. It's almost like a biblical reference as well. Mm-hmm. I was just thinking that. The kind of person he's been. Just fighting for freedom. I doubt the people know the true story, right? They're just told what their king wants them to know. Rope! Oh, man. <laughs> He's trying to say it as, as much as he can. Suffer. Come on. Don't let him go out like this. 
kiss the royal emblem on my cloak, you will feel no more. They're gonna see the amount of endurance this guy's got. Yeah. <sighs> He's not gonna do it, man. Wreck him! Oh, what now? Whatever it is, it can't be good. Look at this. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Jesus. They're gonna try oh. again to keep asking him? Probably. It can all end. Right now. Oh. Please. Just say it. It's crazy the amount of effort they have to put into him saying it. Yeah, they keep trying to break him. He's not breaking. Wow. Yeah, they cannot believe it. They're like, we cannot break this man. Just let him die peacefully, man. You're not like he's not going to ask for mercy. Let him go in peace. Yeah. I was really hoping he wouldn't meet his end. His head was set on London Bridge. His arms and legs sent to the four corners of Britain. Jesus Christ. It did not have the effect that Longshanks planned. Oh, what effect did nice. it have? I hope you've watched your ass this morning. It's about to be kissed by a king. Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen, buddy. Oh, wow. <laughs> Man, he kept it as a reminder. You have bled with Wallace. Now bleed with me. <sighs> <laughs> He's like, no, not this again. <laughs> Was that his sword? I think so. Wow. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Look at them. <laughs> what a sight. He actually managed to unite them, though. Yeah, that's very true. They fought like warrior poets. They fought like Scotsmen and won their freedom. Man. Speechless. Wow. Holy shit. That was really good, man. Man, what an epic that yes. was. That really, really was a, such a phenomenal film. Yeah. And, <laughs> you know, it had so many excellent performances that are that just hit you right in the heart, man. Yeah. Mel Gibson's performance in this was phenomenal. It was fantastic. He was able to capture so much in this. His range was insane from that courage, the bravery to that almost innocence yeah. in the look of his eyes, that purity, that yeah. the his dream, right, of freedom. And every time he spoke about it or he, you know, he had the yeah. same look in his eyes when he spoke about freedom than he did when he spoke about his wife. Yes. It's like with pure adoration, right? You can almost, f it feels so palpable. You can feel why everyone else was so impacted by that, right? By the, by him daring to dream. Yeah. His for goal, that freedom. His and goal was so real. Yeah. He made it real. He made for it everybody real. Else. Yeah. It was real to him and he willed it almost to be real. And it's, it's almost contagious, right? Like we feel it like emanating even from the screen. That that's a fantastic performance. I was so impressed by that. So versatile. You know, the heartbreak, like you felt it. The betrayal, you felt it. Every single bit. He managed to to make us feel so much in this. Yeah. Honestly. And also the direction as well. Can we talk about it? It's these battle sequences. Yes. The shots. You know, the establishing shots that he puts in this, the aerial shots, and then just showing us the scale of the battle. I love when a film does that. We recently just watched Lord of the Rings and I said the yeah. same thing about those battles. Holy shit, man. He really went all in in this. Yes. This is incredible. I can see why till this day it's it's such a staple when people talk about how battles are meant to be done. Right. If I have to say, you know, the biggest compliment or, or what my favorite part 
was out of his direction in this with the battles and we mentioned it during the reaction <laughs> is how much he takes his time to build the tension yeah it's so important for a fight sequence whatever type of action you have right whether it's a one versus one character fight right or an army versus an army setting that up in in a way that it makes sense is so important for the pace of the fight you know because you're mm -hmm. setting up the story of what the fight is right what is the mm -hmm. meaning of this fight and it's the meaning that really captures the audience if your fight has no meaning if there's no story behind it no matter how spectacular you can make it look the audience is just not going to connect they're not going to care for the characters they're not going to care for the story right and i feel like he did such a phenomenal job man and i cannot emphasize that enough in setting the fight sequence the battles in this that and when they finally got there when the battles were about to happen he never once rushed into it right. he was able to build every step of the way until mm -hmm. that very first clash and one thing that i really loved actually also about the fight sequences is through the use of you know the the stunt choreography but also the cinematography and the editing they made the battle feel chaotic gritty right yeah. gritty and how you would expect war to be it didn't look perfectly clean and choreographed it felt like really just a bunch of people just going at it and Rough. just yes it felt like they were out for blood and that is a feeling that's really tough to generate especially when every single piece has to move in a certain way so you can you know maintain everyone's safety mimicking chaos is really difficult and they nailed it with this that's really really impressive also i love the gore can we talk about yeah, that the gore, the gore was, was fantastic. surprising <laughs> it's surprising and, and they knew how to utilize it too they never overdid it it was right. just at the right moments to emphasize mm -hmm. a specific action you know they, they really know how to they really knew i feel like mel gibson really understood how to communicate what he wanted to the audience and i feel like as a director yeah. that's one of those tools that you just need Absolutely. in order to to really make it connect right and i feel like he did that at so many in so many levels here that really makes this film memorable absolutely he was able to make those action sequences connect with audiences but also the character and all the little emotions and intricacies of his his own character right wallace and and managing to do all of that at the different stages while <laughs> still directing and performing i mean that's that's a lot of work, man. And producing, yeah. apparently. He yes. produced this as well. <laughs> so, Jesus, that's a lot of work. So I, I really commend him for taking on so many hats and doing all of them pretty much flawlessly. Like creating chaos in film that looks realistic is so difficult, especially when you have when you have a choreography and you have trained mm -hmm. actors to do these stunts. Yeah. Having it look like, you know, they miss their swings and they right. get it pushed back and it all looks so seamless. So, yeah, I, I agree with you on that point. They did a tremendous job with that. Also, the characters, man, they all have so much heart. Also, as much as we have to praise Mel Gibson's performance, Patrick McGowan in yeah. this uh -oh. as the antagonist, as the king, he was tremendous. I mean, he really, really, really made us hate him, man. He was so vile. Oh, my God. <laughs> it was spectacular. Because you mentioned it, like just that steely, cold gaze. There's nothing. Yeah. In contrast like with Wallace, who has so much compassion and emotion yes. and feels so alive and electric. Yeah. He just feels dead. He's like a walking dead man, really. Yeah. There's nothing behind those eyes. There's yeah. nothing behind those eyes. There is nothing there but contempt. To make that complex is such a feat as an actor. And it was just such a, like, we, I loved hating him yeah. that was so much fun just how vile and disgusting he was in the beginning made his incoming doom that much more satisfying it was like yes he deserves it he deserves to suffer for all of the things that he's done and for all of the suffering that he's caused and all the betrayals that he's forced onto people that was fantastic also i really loved uh angus mefedian's performance yeah so layered and so yeah. complex like you could see again there's moments in this where i freaking hated him especially yeah. right after the betrayal because it was such a hurtful moment man like they were so close they mm -hmm. really were so close to, yeah. to getting somewhere and that betrayal just stings man so you feel the full force of you know what wallace is feeling and that's that's great writing yes. that is really good <laughs> writing because the audience again we feel the same yeah. way that wallace is feeling man but what a performance he he did here where you know you want to hate him but uh, like i mentioned it's it's more complex than you know his own decisions right he has this father who's such a horrible person and he feels the need to to give the father what he wants right and to take the crown because that's what he wants and all that stuff but you see his true character by the way that he is acting with his father the disdain you know yeah. the, the hatred that he has for how his father 
has been acting all all of his life, presumably, mm-hmm. and how he's tired of this, you know, and, and seeing the look that Wallace gave him, which we also saw, that's the point that it broke him. It broke his character because his character has been fighting yeah. all this time against itself to appeal to his father's wishes. As much as Scotland was not free, he also was not free, you know? So it. I feel like in a way, when Wallace screams his final word, which is freedom, I feel like that also gave him permission to actually make the decision to be free, to make the choice that he's always wanted to. Because like we, we could tell from the beginning, he wanted to fight. He wanted to fight for freedom and for his people and for his land. He didn't want to do what his father was telling him to do. He wanted to do the right... The right thing yeah yeah exactly and i really enjoyed the correlation between the state of the country but also the state of him he was just as trapped and he was just as shackled very interesting uh you know thematic parallels there yeah as well as with the biblical references that we had with uh wallace and the way that he was treated right before his death right you know very interesting that yeah he is like the son of scotland in a (laughs) way right and he's the one that's freeing them yet he gets treated this way so yeah Yeah. very heartbreaking to see his demise there but you know i like that the movie ends in such a hopeful tone yes he died hopefully he's out there with his wife finally yeah. having a great time. Maybe she's scolding him for kissing the queen. Who knows? <laughs> I would like to think so. You yeah, know that he had, his, beef. It's okay. he had his happy ever after. That would have been nice. Um, yeah. But at the very least, his objective was done. He managed to yeah. unite Scotland and have all these people fight for and in the name of freedom. At the end of the day, I think that it was a really good arc for his character. I yeah. did not expect him to meet his end. I, I'll Neither be honest. I. I thought this was going to be one of those happy ending films, but nope, you know. <laughs> Uh, there seems to be a theme here. We were so wrong. We lose all of our heroes in our epic films. So yes. well, what are you going to do? But man, overall, I really, really enjoyed this movie. Yeah, I same. thought the cinematography was beautiful too. The fact that they were shooting on location. Man, yeah. more movies have to just, come on guys, just get up your ass, yeah. man. Get, get off your ass and just go film on location. I know it's an extra investment, but it, yeah. it will only make your film timeless. And that's like, I mean, you can't put a price on that. You can't, no amount of green screen, no amount of digital effects will amount to having this sort of visual. Yeah. And I, I say that having the volume now, which is, it does tons of great work for people that need otherworldly terrains that we cannot accomplish. But if right. you can, if you can shoot it on earth, right, if you can <laughs> film it here, film it here, man, like yeah. do it out there, go out there, film the real deal because it's, it's people notice these things. Yeah. Um, you know, technology is getting there. Things are starting to look better than they ever did, even without the green screen things with like like the volume and how mm. you know people like Matt Reeves used it uh, yeah. for the Batman so you know there, there is a, a use for those type of things but if you can just go out and go and shoot it like you know Lord of the Rings or like mm-hmm. this like just go out man and, and do and the thing do it, because yeah. again you're just gonna get a much better product out of it and I think that it's worth the time and it's worth the investment so that being said this film did that absolutely magnificently I yes. mean some of these shots the aerial shots of you know the location <sighs> and, and how you just saw the beautiful nature and mountains yeah. they really set the tone and that combined with the amazing score here <laughs> I was I mean, gonna say James Horner literally went hold my beer yeah it, this was such a beautiful score so haunting and beautiful but also gut-wrenching all at the same time and the the complexities really I feel like they echoed in the actors performances and in, in the vast nature that we got to see like the rolling hills and just Scotland as it is in its own beauty like it helped Helped us fall in love with the land just yeah. as much as Wallace was. And that's just just kudos to the soundtrack. It's absolutely beautiful. Yeah, no, they really managed to have a score that's really a score to be remembered. This yes. one sounded different. Obviously, a lot of the, you know, instruments that are that originated in Scotland and are right? still being used today. Yeah. Love the fact that that was in there because yes. it really gives us such a such personality really and does. weight to the whole score, especially knowing that the whole theme of the movie is the freedom yeah. of this place. Right. So I really really enjoyed that man this movie truly incredible i can see why yeah. a lot of you guys were like hey put that on the list you know i know it didn't win the poll but please watch it and i'm so glad we did yeah. because it was a tremendous watch so guys yeah. thank you so much for watching this with us we hope that you enjoy and we'll catch you guys in the next one take care see ya